You have been on camera since you were six years old, so part of this like red carpet, talking with print reporters is just a part of your life. Do you ever get sick of it? No, I mean, there's not really, it's interesting and it's fun. Um, I love acting, but, and I also, I like sharing it with people. That's, yeah. that's really fun to me. So what do you do when you're not filming Mad Men? I do a lot of sports, actually. Um, I'm on a tennis team. Um, martial arts is quite fun to me. I dance a lot, sing, um, hang out with friends, kind of just normal right. run of the mill. Yeah, I know it's, it's normal. A, it's a, certainly normal. And it's, but you also have an interest in fashion, right? I do. Yeah, that that definitely interests me. Where does that interest come from? I think it just comes from blogs and magazines and all sorts of stuff. Do you have um, another actress on the show whose style you admire? Oh my gosh, I love them all. I think they all have sort of a, a different style to them. January is very edgy. Um, Christina is very classic. And Lizzie's also, she has that very classic style. She does really fun colors. Jessica is very daring. So I think they all just sort of have their own sort of styles. Or, and it sort of represents kind of how their characters are in the show. They're also different in different positions. Um, and work and life. Mm -hmm. And now, have you learned anything about style from Mad Men? Oh, sure. I think that I think in general, Mad Men has sort of brought back a lot of a lot of '60s fashion or retro styles. You can kind of see it appearing a lot more now. And Janie Bryan, our costume designer, is fabulous. She's amazing. She's such a vis visionary. But um, just walking in the room, you see so much, and I love how Sally's fashion has changed over the years. You kind of get a fashion history lesson, which is cool. Yeah, I mean, any outfit they've ever tried to put you in that you're like, oh, no, no way? If we're ever super uncomfortable with the outfit, then we don't have to wear it, but it's pretty much everybody sort of has, you know, what they want you to wear, but it's also, it, it's... I have to give all the credit in the world to Janie. It's it's her thing. Yeah. But at the end of the day, if you're, I've never said no to any outfit unless it's obviously it's too tight or too loose, and if it can't be done, then it can't be done. Yeah. But in the general sense, no. You sort of you sort of wear what whatever you wear. I know. I don't know if you know this, but you've made our Huffington Post best dress list. I Huff did Post see that. Yes, that was really yeah. exciting. And you, you know, you do a really good job of managing to maintain a very youthful look um, while still seeming mature and elegant. And I'm curious where that direction comes from. I think it's just honestly. I think it's just my personal style. I love those sort of old Hollywood silhouettes, and I love the Grace Kellys and the Audrey Hepburns, so I, th I think it just it sort of comes from there. Yeah, but you wear a lot of Oscar de la Renta, which I, I mean, amazing. Who I wouldn't do, want to yeah. wear a lot of Oscar de la Renta? But it's generally thought of as an older woman's designer. Mm -hmm. And you are not an older woman at I'm all. I'm not, no. <laughs> it's still so fun to wear, though. I think his designs are beautiful. That's it? It just, that's, you just love them? I do. I think that there's a really appealing quality to, um, his work just because they're just so beautifully crafted and they're timeless, mm -hmm. which is, I mean, you could pull out that piece in the 60s and it would fit right in and now it just looks just as perfect as well. So I think that's something really special. I they hear, sort of transcend time. Yeah. I hear you've made some of your own clothes as well. I have attempted to. <laughs> um, I, it took me about one year to make a dress, and by the time I made it, I had already grown out of it. So I wouldn't really consider it a successful well, if, if you, thing. I, if you continue <laughs> on with that, I feel like you could be pretty successful. I have tried to sew multiple times, and it just it doesn't work. I love wearing fashion, but I just I don't have the talent of sewing.